okay friends so welcome to a new video on win versus droid and i have you euphoria running stock android in front of me now today i'll demonstrate the new app that was released by micro sorry firefox now that's firefox 2.5 preview for android now it's not uh it's just a launcher and if you like it then you can even uh, flash it on your android device uh, the thing that i'm going to show you is just a launcher it's just an app it's an apk 88.3 mb if you can see that okay now you can download it from mozilla website next 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 it will ask you to your preference for installation do select the internal device storage because you might face some problems with the sorry about that you might face some problem if you install it in the sd card so let's select internal storage so it's installing now i also have here my zen ultra phone 105 this is running firefox os so we will be comparing these two as well the firefox launcher for android with the firefox os now this is running let's have a look at the version it's running 1.3.0 that's pre-release okay so app has been installed now let's open now for that you need to go to settings and change the home launcher this tribucat is your default i have also installed the microsoft's new launcher that was launched arrow and let's select firefox os developer preview so it's installing so it's loading Okay, so it says Fox Food Community Edition. You get this welcome screen. Some problem with my with the focusing of my Lumia 520. Okay, so this is the welcome screen welcome to firefox os developer preview an experimental app from mozilla that lets you experience firefox os you can provide feedback and all sort of stuff done so this is the home screen that you get something some spider kind of icon at the top I have no idea what's that for now this is different from the firefox os that i have on my this phone this thing has a vertical scrolling here you have the notification similar to one that we find on this okay first of all let's have a look at the lock screen of both these devices okay so this does not have that lock screen effect now let's look at the notification so here is how it looks 
we have Wi-Fi, aeroplane mode, Bluetooth, settings. I don't know what this thing. And your notifications come over here. Let's go to settings. This is how settings looks. Network and connectivity. Geolocation. Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, internet sharing, sound, you get some more options over here, like SIM manager, call settings, message settings, cellular and data settings, which you don't get over here, then your sound, display, you would have extra settings on this phone, because this is a proper Firefox OS device while this is just an app on the left you have do not track now this middle button gives extra feedback just like this button and on this side you have horizontal scrolling while here you have vertical scrolling and on the second home page you can pin pages or websites from the browser let's keep this thing aside now and have a proper look at this you have this this effect nice little effect bump effect Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, internet sharing you can make this a Wi-Fi hotspot USB tethering probably these two buttons won't act only the home button acts sound you have different options unlock screen nothing display you can adjust the brightness but there's no effect on this phone you can log the orientation this is just to give you an idea of how firefox os acts home screen you can select different wallpapers and you can also change the icon layout from three columns to four columns you can change the home screen you can get more home screens from the marketplace that's if you have it installed search you can change the search engine from these options have duck duck go as well ok navigation notifications you have a swipe gesture drag from left or right edge of the screen to jump between apps we will try to test that out date and time language keyboards you have certain options for the keyboard you can also have regional languages and various other international languages as per your choice <coughs> you have a find my device option you can locate and lock or erase your phone for that you need to create an account screen lock has been disabled let's enable maybe that would be a password ok so here you get the lock screen firefox style 
on swiping to the left you can go to camera and right to unlock that was nice let's keep it off for now you can give control the app permissions you can enable do not track have various options you can read this pause it and read this browsing privacy you get a private browsing option over here cracking protection clear history delete cookies usb storage media storage application storage device info so it's okay it's actually 2.6.0 and we had 1.3.0 pre-release this is 2.6.0 pre-release you can check for updates have more information about the os your rights privacy downloads battery you have a power saving mode seems like there has been a lot of improvement from what i saw on this device accessibility color filter audio input have a developer option you can select various options and you can provide a feedback and all that stuff this thing doesn't work well this thing brings seems like it got hanged Okay, seems like it this who got hanged. I'll come back in a minute. Okay, so I had to uninstall and reinstall it again. There is some developed some problem. Uh, so avoid using this back as well as this multitasking button. Only use this home button since Firefox has only one button. That's the home button. Okay, so now let's have a look at the UI contents. Here you have the dialer. That's the dialer. Contacts. Call log. At the top you have this search. You can search anything. This is the keyboard of Firefox. You can search over here. Messaging new message this is how it looks contacts i showed you you can have email you have firefox browser over here got it you can enter something let's try phone arena So it does load up pretty nice gallery music video marketplace let's see if it shows on the new design of the marketplace taking a lot of time maybe it won't show you have calendar clock this looks quite nice calendar decent we have settings we just saw that saw that usage
you need a sim card for that and rest are just android features the rest are just the android apps that i have on my phone now you can swipe from the edges to switch between the apps let's try it it's not happening okay when you press the home button you get the multitasking option let's try it from some apps okay so it's working now you have in settings calendar marketplace galleries own arena contacts so that's working fine now let's see if you can pin this page when you click on the three dots over here at the top you get these options so let's try to pin is it asks you whether you want to pin a page or the site let's pin this page okay so page has been pinned to home screen let's see okay so you can see firefox.com over here and it loads up without any issues so that's great there seems to be a lot of improvements as compared to this older version so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i need to conclude this thing over here so thank you guys for watching this video and have a nice day.